Welcome back. Well, house calls made by doctors see a comeback. One physician's assistant we talked with hopes so. In our ongoing series, The Rebound Tampa Bay, we're showcasing the ways people and businesses in the Bay Area are rebounding from the pandemic. And tonight, ABC Action News Rebound reporter Michael Paluska shows us why having a medical professional come to your home could become the new norm once again. You know, getting medical care in the comfort of your own home used to be pretty normal. In the 1930s, according to the American Academy of Family Physicians, more than 40% of doctor-patient visits happened inside a home. But now, they are almost unheard of. <laughs> Did you think it was going to hurt? Physician's assistant Jennifer Boyd is working hard to change that. For 11 years, she's been on the front lines of emergency care. I've only done trauma and emergency medicine. In December, with COVID-19 cases surging, she launched House Calls for Kids, a business she wanted to start for years. People were afraid to leave. The pandemic creating an opportunity for her to help families stay safe and healthy. Once we started doing it, we've been, I've been to people's houses six, seven plus times now because they just have had such a wonderful experience with everything. And it does feel safer. You have a little bit more control over the environment. Stick your tongue out. Hey, ah. Uh. I was with Boyd as she Perfect. checked out sisters Abigail and Maggie. They needed health forms filled out for summer camp. Perfect. Yeah, I could have taken them to the pediatrician, but that would be a big production. So instead, we called House Calls for Kids, and it's just so much easier. So my kids are running around the house instead of running around a waiting room. Abigail and Maggie are just two of Sarah Albert's four kids. They were all very well behaved during our interview, but anyone with kids knows that is not always the case. Albert tells me just getting all four into the car is a challenge. To be able to stay home and not take them to the pediatrician's office or to the hospital especially, um, that sounds like a much better option. And if a kid gets sick, House Calls for Kids does same day service. Just in general, there are so many times where your child starts to feel sick after dinner at bedtime and you just don't know, is this something I really need to go to the emergency room for? We've seen very critically ill patients to just normal cough and colds, which gives us that ability to be able to see if there's something more critical that needs to be taken to the emergency center if it's not something we can manage at home. Boyd is seeing repeat customers and says the service is catching on. No long waits in the emergency room, at the doctor's office, and something else. We wear masks, we sanitize everything, everything's clean before we come, so there's limited new germs coming into the house. Yeah. And they're not bringing their kids to a place where there are a bunch of germs already. Thank you. Good job. <laughs> In St. Petersburg, Michael Paluska, ABC Action News. So here is the rebound rundown tonight. Boyd's team works seven days a week and does same day services. She's now juggling her work as a PA and making house calls to get the business off the ground. For more information, go to our website at abcactionnews.com and click on the rebound section.